We only see the aftermath, and it is painful. There's actually debris that has actually been cast aloft into the atmosphere. It is also a science, a science that is broken down in this room. When those colors are very close together like that, that gives you a very strong signature of rotation. We are at the National Weather Service Station in Fort Worth. Tom Bradshaw has been doing this 29 years. We basically measure the points from the beginning to the end. It is their job to take a snapshot in time, provide alerts, and then look at snapshots of the aftermath to see just how bad it was. Uplift of the roof and some partial loss of the roof. The pictures tell the story. The damage analyzed by previous wind studies helped them rate these tornadoes. North Dallas saw an EF3 tornado tear through. At varying degrees, it circled the ground for 32 minutes. This is this is a pretty long-term event. Um, they're usually not on the ground for that long. They're not on that ground on the ground for that length of time. 32 minutes is a long time. The longer it's on the ground, the more widespread the devastation. The fact that nobody has died is what Tom calls a miracle. The National Weather Service sent crews through Dallas and Rockwall and Sachse. On Tuesday, they'll head to Ellis and Kaufman and Erath counties to study the damage, to study what took so much from so many people. In Fort Worth, I'm Jordan Panicker.